Yo, what it do, YouTube? It's your boy Spray Paint back at you with another video. The other half of it's time for that Coach for the Street podcast, man. Top of the morning, man. Hit that like button. So, this video here is about FBG Butter versus King AK47. And plus, we're going to tone into a, uh, what them boys got going on over there in Chicago on the peace side, man. But anyway, FBG Butter. And King AK-47 was going back and forth online. And basically, Butter was making himself look like a straight jackass, dog. Because he kept asking King AK-47, like, what make you think I'm the police? Like, define the police. Now, Butter, you know these videos that circulating on YouTube of you snitching on the dudes that jumped on you when you supposed to be going down there to the law library to go look at some shit and you turn around and said when you got down there they tried to make you sign the affidavit that's what he talking about bro that's what everybody is talking about because you know you was calling yourself you know this this certain type of gangster and all this right here but you got videos of you crying you know what I mean? Not saying that gangsters and thugs don't cry. But nigga, not you. You feel me? And King AK-47 ain't waste no time. Like, he lit that boy ass up. I'm talking about he told that fool, you need to change your name from FBG Butter to FBI Butter. And then he kept saying, like, nigga, we ain't gonna let your bitch ass talk at all. Like... Instead of saying, uh, I don't know who else was co-signing, but he was saying, like, y'all keep them rat emojis coming down there in the comments. And, bruh, you know King AK-47. That fool ain't got no filter at all. I'm talking about, boy, he cooked his ass the whole live stream. Kept, <laughs> he kept saying, shut your bitch ass up, nigga. I ain't gonna let you talk. Nigga, shut up. Nigga, you done told enough, nigga. Change your motherfucking name to FBI Butter with your police ass. But. Yeah, man, but on to the next. Man, we got FYB, J Main, J H E Ruger, King Yellow, gets 051 Kiddo on the live stream. And you basically see FYB, J Main begging. 051 kiddo to keep the peace with Tay Savage and the BDs. You feel me? Um, I think that is one of the most positivest moves I ever seen ever done when it come down to Chicago music scene, period. Because these boys really is trying to change the narrative and they trying to get a leader a, a leader from every section in Chicago to come forward and try to do something positive for the youth. You know what I mean? You, you got FYB, J. Main, even asking Chief Keith for a co-sign on his Whoop series. You feel me? It's, 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 it's not going to happen overnight, but like they were saying on the live stream, it's a start because... They was like, you know, we got we got a leader from each section, but we need somebody from Young Money. And, you know, Kiddo was basically saying he'll talk to Driller about it. And, you know, they was basically saying that's a that's a that's a start because the kids, they trying to make a they trying to make a change for the youth. And, you know, what I mean, you know, Kiddo, he came home. You know, on the bullshit, dissing all of the ops, dropping rakes, whatever the case may be. But at the same time, if they put all of the bullshit to the side, not saying niggas got to hang together and all that because, you know, everybody grown. But if if boys just put their pride to the side, like men, Chicago will make a lot of money because the whole world is copying Chicago whole swag when it come down to music, when it come down to the lingo, the wordplay, everything. 
everybody looking up to Chicago. I don't care what nobody says. So for them to try to change the narrative and like grown men, like really try to try to really put the bullshit to the side and 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 move forward, I can't do nothing but tilt my hat to them guys, especially FYBJ Main, because he literally was begging kiddo, like, please, bro, we need you. We need you. We got to stop this. We, 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 we pushing peace. Like, it's no way somebody can hate on a brother that's, that's pushing peace to stop the violence. You know what I mean? At least try to decrease it. I ain't saying it's going to stop as a whole because it's a lot going on out there in them streets. But, man, that's a big old move, man. So I tilt my hat. I tilt my hat to them brothers because they trying. And maybe it'll be a domino effect if other cities see what these what type of time these boys on when it comes down to trying to stop the violence and, and show the youth a different view of life. Y'all leave a drop a comment down there in the comment section, man, to tell me how y'all feel about that, man. I'm gone.